Okay, so the idea here is that we're going to put an SSTO into orbit and then transform it into a space station. Now, I've had this idea for a while, but I've been having problems with the building of this thing. More specifically, the building of a larger version of this. I decided then to go for something a bit smaller and something that will not put my computer into a slow crawl while trying to launch her up into orbit. I think what it is, something to do with the docking ports on this, which is puts each part separately. I'm not entirely sure. I've sent bigger things with more parts up into orbit before, but for some reason this slowed my computer down to about 7 frames per second while not at this point. It's sort of like it starts to lag a bit more and a bit more as you get up further and further. It's probably something to do with the mods and this isn't the latest version of Caspi, so yeah. Oh, and a quick note before those eagle-eyed you. The Delta V discrepancy there, we're at 10,000, we were about 13,000, we're further down. This is the second launch, and I stopped recording the first launch, and I forgot to start recording the second launch, but I didn't have time to record another launch of this thing. Even though it says 7 minutes, or 5 minutes up in the top corner, this is going 4 times slower than that. So yeah, imagine 4 times speed being normal speed, but 4 times slower is... Well, is full time slower speed, where I'm that's what I'm trying to say. Anyway, I went off point. What I was trying to say was that I added extra fuel into this one because I didn't have enough fuel to get into it because I was sort of like fiddling with fuel while I was doing the tests and I was finding out that uh, it was flipping out controls, so it was emptying fuel, filling fuel here and whatnot. So it was all over the shop. But anyway, now I've got a stable version of it which gets into orbit, and that's all I can ask for. Anyway, the design of this, I thought was brilliant. You have the main body of the station at the front, the big lumpy part here with all the docking ports on it, and then you had the wings which are swept back, but they're not connected to the back of the spacecraft. That's purpose, and it's also aesthetically pleasing. Now, it looks like a junkyard ship, I suppose, but it's, I think it's an awesome design, if I do say so myself. Something you know, like a junkyard, it's it's made, built for purpose, not for stylishness, except for the wings. The wings are stylish. Now, I could have built this so that every part was reused, but I neglected the rocket engines. They're going to be discarded as well as the intakes because the docking ports are on the end of the intakes. Also, after launching this up into orbit, I found one infuriating flaw bug to my design. And that was that the decoupler, as you can see by here, is going over the length of the docking port. So once I was trying to dock that, that was in the way of it actually docking. Anyway, here's a couple of other fails that I've done. First off, fully saber engined up. Got into space. Orbit rune was 500 meters per second. Not that much, but I only got 176 meters per second. Fail two. A lot of crashing. You can call this... The multiple failure, uh, I don't know, <laughs> I just thought this crash was awesome to put in it, and of course there's going to be multiple crashes in it. Fail 3. Weight distribution, at least I think this is weight distribution. The fuel at the front, this took me ages to work out by the way, the fuel at the front wasn't being drained properly, and I think I didn't set them to drain at the right rate. Third fail, personal failures. Damn it, it can't be asked. Let's mess around and just uh, decouple things. Yes, these were the failures where I decided I'm giving up. Let's just uh, let's just mash everything up. Anyway, the bit that you've been waiting for. Space plane, transform.
and there you have it. A space station, a space plane has been transformed into a space station. Now, I could develop upon this and sort of like send it to other worlds perhaps, and it'll be an awesome little trick. Not practical, by the way, because SST has used a lot of fuel to enter orbit. That Elon Musk has the right idea of reusing parts. Anyway, I had the spare SSTO in orbit, so I thought, why not go and dock it to our space station? So I set up a quick rendezvous and then a lovely docking sequence. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, crank that like button like an engineer, or hit it, or smack it, or do something with it, please. Even if you want to use a dislike button. I'm Orbiter. Trust me, I'm an engineer. And tell me if you like this idea. Ooh, look, buttons. Let's press them. <laughs>